episode 13. Well, on this episode, we went to 1770, had a foreshore stay at a campsite there, mm -hmm. and now we're at uh, Gum Trees Lodge and Bush Camp. <laughs> Here's our little uh, camping uh, caravan park. Looks like they cram them in. Watch out for the tree. So, yeah, the, that branch. Yep. Yep, okay. Nice. Yeah. Hang on, I'm just going to walk down onto the beach and get some footage here from the little uh, caravan park at uh, 1770. Um, literally everybody's camped directly opposite to the water. Well, not there's you know, a couple of rows back as well, but um, the prime spots are right here, right here on the water. Check that out. Looks like a uh, nice afternoon for beer o'clock down on the water here. Yeah, I can't We are. We are here. We are here. Both of us. No bikes. I'm here. Yeah, what is it with 1770? No bikes. You can't ride your bike in the caravan park. You can't have a skateboard. And on this boardwalk in the walkway, no bikes. Fifteen minutes ago, we pulled up at Gumtree Lodge and Bush Camp, uh, just out of Childers. I think it's called Howard here. And uh, Debbie and George, the owners, have given us a really uh, special site. It's got a, a deck that overlooks the uh, the dam, and uh, I guess the premium sites. Uh, but as you can see, uh, there's the dam outside. It's bloody wet. Isn't it? 
<laughs> don't hide behind there. My hair's wet. I don't care. Don't hide behind there. Say hello. Hi. Yeah. Have, well. Lucky we have a fridge in the van so I can still have my wine. <laughs> There is a little fridge down here, and Brass we're stocked up. Yeah, brass monkeys. Look them up. Cheap, and uh, they work really well. And if you're uh, stuck in your van in the rain, um, with you know not much to do, then you're gonna need a drink we'll or it. Monopoly. Hmm. Uh, we'll go. We'll go outside when the rain stops, anyway, because the view outside is beautiful. The timber deck is amazing. And we'll just put the awning out. We can just sit out there and look over the water. There's little lights out there at night time. She's still hiding. <laughs> but we'll take you for a walk anyway. It's a great property. How's the spot? Sensational. So peaceful, so relaxing. The owners of this property is so taken Debbie and George. Over two years ago. And they've done a lot of work here so far, and I think there's a lot of work to come. So it's um, yeah, it's a beautiful spot. So they've come up with these ideas with these decks for people to use their caravans, motorhomes. Um, it's for over 50s, no kids, so it's nice and peaceful. You can have pet friendly. Um, <laughs> don't get too close. I have a cold sore. <laughs> yeah. Trip in a van had a cold sore. She did. I love her. So this is the um, entry here, you turn in and there's all these uh, old pumps, all the old petrol pumps lining the driveway. Somebody's obviously got a interest in um, retro Golden Fleece, an old Australian service station, old Coke signs. And we'll go and show you uh, George and Debbie's display that they call George's Diner. But it's not a real diner. It's just a display. But it's pretty impressive. It'd be great if it was a real diner. Old oh, pink caddy. <laughs> you're, you're really good. Well, this is not what you expect to find in a rural campsite. So good for the working diner, that'd be awesome. But I do believe they've gone in a night too, so that'd be something to think about. Oh, you know, maybe you get a Buddy Holly uh, 
uh, sing her in and uh, do some 50 stuff. Gum Tree Lodge and Bush Camp and uh, they've got a wonderful little bush camp here. Um, why don't you tell us a little bit about it? Well we've been here for two years. We uh, had a caravan park in the Whit Sundays and prior to that one in Innisfail so we came down here with 23 years experience and people used to tell us that they didn't need much they had everything on board so when we sold two years ago we thought we would build something just for the nomad crowd that had their own showers and toilets on board and everything else that they need. Uh, so we just kept it really, really simple and we get a great crowd in. We have lots of fun still. and um, Lots of good people here and uh, yeah, everybody's self-contained. So, yeah. and no kids. Well, it's not that we don't want kids. We've done all that before and there's some great operators out there doing some really good stuff. We didn't want to be competing with them. But um, we just wanted to keep it to an older crowd that are mature and, you know, <laughs> mature, quiet, yes. like Most us. Of them are mature. Yeah, mature. They just wanted something quiet and simple and, you know, it's good. It's great. Oh, good. You've got to come well. and check this out. Watch the video, see what you think, and um, yeah, come and check it out. And Debbie, Debbie and George are beautiful people too, so oh. I highly recommend you coming here. You've got to check out George's diner. He's a collector, it's cool.